The first human trials of a coronavirus vaccine in Europe are taking place right now in Britain. This is a significant step with several countries racing to find ways to fight the illness now blamed for more than 191,000 deaths worldwide. MTS Tayab looks at the highly anticipated new study. So I need a scratch. It may just be one small shot, but it's possibly one giant leap in the fight against the coronavirus. In Britain, Alyssa Granado is the first volunteer in the world to receive this potential vaccine. I'm a scientist, so of course I want to try and support science, um, the scientific process whenever I can. You ready? Human trials like this would normally take years to develop, but has been achieved in just three months by the experienced team of scientists at Oxford University, who say not only does this vaccine have an 80% chance of being effective, it could also be ready for use as early as September. I have a high degree of confidence about this vaccine because it's technology that I've used before. Of course, we have to test it. But until a vaccine is found, countries desperate to reopen their economies may look to Sweden. The Scandinavian nation has kept its schools and businesses open to help the general population build immunity, a goal they believe they're within weeks of. Still, more than 2,000 people have died there, which is hundreds more than neighboring countries with tighter controls. We are not uh, telling people to stay indoors. I think that's um, a, a very important part of our policy. Back in Oxford, and scientists concede the only way they'll know for sure if their vaccine is a success is if lots of volunteers are exposed to the coronavirus. But with the UK still under strict lockdown, the irony is you need to go somewhere like Sweden to do that. For CBS This Morning, Impia Sayab, London.